one of the biggest art centers in the southeast, and it's right there in the middle of Dunedin, right downtown. The Dunedin Fine Art Center is offering a chance to expand your world through art classes. I'm Virginia Johnson. Coming up, we're on the town with the head of adult education, an artist himself. Stay with us. By taking a class at the Dunedin Fine Arts Center, you can become a part of a community of local creatives. Mm -hmm. It is a new way to express yourself and meet your potential tribe. Our Virginia Johnson is on the town in Dunedin with the story. Artist Dion Blackwell is extruding a hollow clay tube. Basically, if you ever had a uh, Play-Doh fun factory, this is the equivalent for ceramics. The lifelong artist and teacher is the new head of adult education at the Dunedin Fine Arts Center. He gives huge props to the instructors. Those guys are crazy advanced over me. I get my MFA, but those guys are writing the literal books on clay processes and they live right here in this area. And it's not just clay. Blackwell's first project I got to go through the entire catalog and set all the classes. There's wood turning, stone carving, even Mayan backstrap weaving. Something for everybody. Blackwell says art changes you. And then I'm going to take it off the platter. And here is a flip. It expands your life. Oh yeah, I love this stuff. I have to be careful, I'll get lost just building out here at times. Here's a look at some of the art he creates. They're kind of meant to be sort of people-ish. I like the lumpy kind of characters and the ones that are kind of telling a story that you don't understand. One thing Blackwell does understand, the impact art can have on all ages. We teach art and we have lots of stuff in the, the schools for, for art when we're young, but when we, when we get older, we forget that that is super beneficial just to be able to make something with your hands. And remember the magic. In Wesley Chapel, Virginia Johnson, Spectrum News. New classes start on January the 8th, and there is a week of workshops in February. And the second winter class session starts February 26th. Now, we've got more online at baynews9.com.